A law generations in the making. President Joe Biden signing the Emmett Till anti-lynching bill into law. WGN's Megan Dwyer is live in our newsroom with the story. Megan. It's on, Micah. Civil rights leaders today calling this a historic day, a triumphant day. And finally, after nearly 200 tries over the years, this is finally a law. Hundreds, hundreds of similar bills have failed to pass. Surrounded by the families of Emmett Till and Ida B. Wells today in Washington, President Biden signed legislation that officially makes lynching a federal hate crime. No federal law expressly prohibited lynching, none, until today. Congressman Bobby Rush, who says he's elated today, spearheaded the legislation. Rush brought his grandson to the signing today to witness history. In a statement, he wrote, quote, we will no longer face the question of if a perpetrator of lynching will be brought to justice. The maximum sentence for lynching now is 30 years in prison. Today, President Biden recalled the story of Chicago's own Emmett Till. It was 1955. He was 14 years old when he went to visit his cousins in Mississippi. His mother put him on the train with a kiss and a warning. She told him the unwritten rules she had to follow. Quote, be very careful how you speak. Say yes, sir, and no, ma'am. And do not hesitate to be to humble yourself if you have to get down on your knees. End of quote. He would not make it home alive. Men, women, and children hung by nooses from trees, bodies burned and drowned and castrated. Their crimes? trying to vote, trying to go to school, trying to own a business. A past that cannot and must not be forgotten. It's, it's really pretty emotional. Especially for Chicagoans fighting for justice and forgiveness as part of the path forward. The real story of black America is the story of triumph uh, against all odds. Um, and, and so we're very proud today. We're very grateful to Congressman Rush and we are depending on ourselves to make sure that we use this tool um, in, a, in a really, really fiery way. Congressman Rush is also working on giving a congressional gold medal to Till and his mother, Mamie, and having the post office make a stamp in his mother's honor. Micah? Thank you, Megan.